What's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. Look, y'all Cleveland Cavalier fans, y'all need to just shut the fuck up. I don't want to hear that shit about Kevin Durant going to a 73 and 19. Hey, LeBron left first. You know what I'm saying? Get the fuck out of here with y'all bullshit. When when LeBron left, y'all was burning his motherfucking jerseys. So get the fuck out of here like y'all just love LeBron so much. Oh, and I'm gonna tell you right now, you probably gonna leave again. So just prepare for it. LeBron James, nobody don't want to hear that bullshit. He will never fucking be Michael Jordan. He will never fucking be Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. It's MJ, Kareem, or Kareem, MJ. Whichever order, you want to pick them. I got Kareem number one. I got Jordan number two. And then Tim Duncan number three. So, I mean, come on, man. He passed the motherfucking ball, man. They had the game secure, even though the referees went out of their way to help Cleveland win and the NBA, and they and they still couldn't get the job done. I mean, y'all got more excuses than a motherfucker going to jail, man. Y'all got more excuses than a cop shooting an unarmed black person. Oh, I thought he had a gun. Oh, I didn't. man, just get the fuck out. Stop fucking making excuses. LeBron is a front runner. Kevin Durant seized the moment. He lived for the moment. He wasn't afraid to take a big shot. See, that's the difference. Stephen Curry will take a big shot. Clay Thompson will take a big shot. But LeBron passed the motherfucking ball as you fucking serious. You already down 2-0. Your season is on the line and you passed the motherfucking ball and you got these clowns like Isaiah Thomas sitting up saying, oh, by the way, man, I don't I don't fucking destroy Isaiah Thomas in a video later on today. I'm going to expose his ass, too, on that bullshit about he would take LeBron over Michael Jordan. I'm going to expose Isaiah Thomas for a fucking liar that he is. Hey, get the fuck out of here with that bullshit. Now, all I can say to Cleveland, go back to doing what y'all do best. You know, snitching on motherfuckers. Asking for cigarettes before you tell on a motherfucker. Because at the end of the day, the Warriors are going to win this series. It's nothing that Adam Silver can do. It's nothing that the refs can do. Well, then again, yeah, I'll be honest. If Adam Silver and the refs don't interfere, the Warriors win on Friday. They'll blow. I, I think the Warriors are going to blow Cleveland out by 20 points on Friday. They're going to humiliate Cleveland in Cleveland. I wouldn't be surprised if the Warriors run up the score because they want to humiliate LeBron because they want to take his heart away. And I'm going to tell you something. It ain't nothing that you Cleveland Cavalier fans can do about it. It is what it is, man. I'm out.